So we want to start over, start the day counter over again. You hold down the reset button until it clears it out. Of course, now that didn't clear out very well. Okay, you, well, I guess it just doesn't want to. That's okay. The important thing is the day counter. Right, to set the temperature, well, the temperature comes preset from the factory at 38 degrees Celsius, which equals 100.4 degrees Fahrenheit. But if you wanted to change it, this is the set button with a little gear on it. It says press that, and then you can press the up and down arrow to put it where you want it. And I might just put it there, and then you press set again. Okay? All right, to set the low temperature alarm, you hold the set button for three seconds, and then you go around until you get to AL, you press set again. And you can set it for how many degrees off. Like if it falls two degrees, an alarm will go off, and you hit set. Set the high temperature alarm, you do the same thing. You hold the set button for three seconds, then you go find AH, and you press it again, and you can move it up or down. But I'm gonna leave it at the factory setting of one degree because I don't I want the alarm to go off if it gets too hot. For setting the humidity, you hold the set button and you arrow around till you find AS and then hit set. And its factory setting is 60%. Uh, percent. But I'm gonna put it at 58. It's already 58 and set. And uh, probably if it goes a little bit lower than 58, a couple of degrees, one or two degrees, the alarm will go off. You, the only way you can control though the humidity is by adding water. I would start the incubator probably with no water because if you add a little bit, well here in Central Texas where it's very humid already. If you add a little water at the beginning, the humidity is gonna be up at 70 and 75 on your first day, and you only want it to be like 55 or 60, so. I would wait to put water in until after you have started your eggs for a couple days and watch and see what it does. So it's here in the manual. Uh, yeah, you wanna uh, make sure the eggs don't have any cracks, and when you put the eggs in the incubator, you want to put them in there with the pointy end of the egg down. And if you shine a light through the eggs at day six, you should be able to see some little veins and a little embryo, and then day eight should be bigger, and so on.